Alright guys, how's it going? It's um, Noah here again. Sorry I haven't been making any videos, but um, I just got a box not so long ago. I already opened it, looked at it, made sure it was legit. Um, debating if I want to wear it or not. As you guys can tell, you guys know what could possibly be in here. So let me go ahead take this box out. And try to see how or what we can do here. So this is my very first pair. Never did own one till now. Um, I did get this from the GOAT app. A lot of the sneakerheads out there may know what the app is about, what you can purchase on it. I'm Yeezy Busta did say it's all legit, so I decided to call me a pair because why not? So as you can see, the 350. You guys may know, obviously some Yeezys, some Boost. Um, I did get me a size nine half. Oh, 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 oh! Which way? Which way? This way. Nine half. So they are my size. This is nine half is my true size. Uh, I did not know if they run big or if they run small. So, I mean, I just got me a nine half just to see how they'd feel. Still debating if I want to wear them. If I want to. I want to sell them. These are the zebras. I love the zebras. I love the way how they look. Uh, they honestly match with anything. I can even get it fully out of the box. It's the box. So when you purchase from Goat, you do get this amazing Goat um, notification paper card, whatever you want to call it. It says, uh, our goal is to be the most truest marketplace for sneakers and some information about authentication and all that. And it also says, we hope you enjoy them and thank you for your purchase. So this shoe, every, every shoe that comes in, somebody has to authenticate it. So this was authenticated by Jay. Thanks, Jay. You're the best. And down to everybody's been waiting for. So, let's see if I can bring you a little close. All right. So these are the zebras. Um, very nice. Never wore them. Tried them on just to see how they'll feel. So this is not, you know, my first time seeing these out of the box. Um, so far so clean. They got the three stripes for the Adidas. Uh, I don't know what else to say about them. I mean. They're legit. I know that for a fact. I mean, I paid good amount for these. Not too expensive, not too cheap. I like them. Well, who knows? I mean, I posted a picture. Um, I posted a picture on Instagram about them. Seems pretty fire to me. Honestly, this is just like me joining the hype, I guess you could say. And then, uh, yeah, so here's the tag, never took them off. And, uh, who knows, maybe I'll give you guys a little try on on my foot, see how it looks like. I love these. These are nine half. When I try them on, some thick socks, they do feel a little, they feel very fitted, especially on the, the left foot. 
it'll kind of feel over here like I could feel the the bottom sole so I don't know maybe I just have to take off the the insole but you know they do have the number you know Adidas logo pretty legit boost feels amazing um when I bought these I also did buy another pair of another Adidas shoe with Boost. Maybe I'll, man, I'll end up making a video on those, but I think for now those may be my beaters. Right now I just have NMDs that are beaters, so I'm not too sure. But um, yeah, so as everybody knows, these are the Zebras. I love them to death. I may be wearing them. They do suit my style. I love Boost. I mean, I, I've been a huge fan of Adidas, I mean, I do have some Nike shoes, but you know, Adidas did step up their game with Boost. I did fall in love with that, Kanye West made these, these were a whole big hype, I wanted, I wanted to personally see how they came first hand from GOAT, or, you know, me owning a pair personally. What I mean by that is to spend a you know crazy amount of money, you know, a thousand to maybe like five hundred for the creams or for you know a thousand dollars for the breads. I mean, I personally think they're a big hype, you know, they they can resell for you know huge value, so I mean, if you have the money, I'd say cop one, but, you know, if you can't, i just say, you know, stick with some, you know, Ultra Boost, NMDs, whatever. But, uh, I did have money laying around, decided to cop a pair. Thankfully, I did. The market was a little low for, uh, the price and my size, so I see, I feel that I came up with a good deal. Um... Stay tuned for my next pair of shoes. I did see Easy Busta just uh, bought the frozen yellow um, V2s that you know early release whatever from Goat. He did say that they were um, authentic to what his understanding is. So I mean, I looked up the pricing. It's like ridiculously in the thousands. Easy. So I'm trying to wait for the date when it comes out. It comes out this month just for the frozen yellows. Um, give it a few weeks and then uh, after the frozen yellows come out, the midnight blue or whatever it be called and the maroon, maroonish red, whatever. Tint of these will come out. So I can't wait. I mean, I'm not going to try to cop them. Resale value. I'm gonna try to cop them retail. I'm here in Vegas, so hopefully a lot of stores have them. If not, then I can settle for less. Uh, don't mind wearing these, but uh, really trying to get a hand on the Ultra Boost Haven. So thank you guys for watching on my new sneaker pickup. I mean. Trying to get back into vlogging again, but I uh, just moved up to Vegas, so I don't know. We'll see how it goes, but uh, stay tuned for more content and give this video a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, do what you got to do, and uh, stay tuned. Maybe I might have more Yeezys, maybe not. Who knows? Cheers.